me yeah you guys are being kidding to me <laughs> i was trying to do most voice by the way okay so basically today is april fool's day happy april fool's day um if any of you gamers are basically watching this video right now and i actually had to go to GameStop earlier just to get my deku socks and i got some cinnamon crocker socks to snack on okay so nintendo said that yesterday is the last day that they're supposed to be selling the Supermod 3d all-stars right because the, the reason why i had to come back here again today is because um, yesterday's the last day, they're supposed to be having it on the shelves because Cro Nintendo said that, you know, they're supposed to be out of sales, um, both, uh, in retail and digital. However, where I'm from, okay, this Walmart down here that I used to go to, they still have it on the shelf. So basically, I was like a little bit shocked that, one, basically the price is $50. It's supposed to be 60 but they jotted it down to, um, basically ten dollars and it was actually done here when i checked yesterday and apparently if you can see on my side they got oopsie coxie goldman nathan bc pussy like basically like seven copies so the good news is nintendo actually kind of how i'm gonna say this at least in my opinion they kind of pranked us because i thought they were actually not supposed to be any more copies which is good for me if i actually want to get this game later on even though i got my deku socks so you can still, at least where I'm from, um, you can still get the Super Mario 3D All Stars. There's a lot in um, in stock right now, and yeah, there was like literally three down here yesterday with the Assassin's Creed 3, and believe it or not, they got more on stock. So I think that's a hoax on the Tino's end because basically the way they're doing this is because they want people to actually buy the game because seeing that the sales went up by I think 275 plus percent, and basically. Nintendo, like, you shouldn't have been doing that to us, not trying to be rude or anything, because that actually gives us gamers, or at least um, my old um, fanboys, anxiety just to actually buy the game. So, just let you know, basically, you can get Super Mario 3D All Stars. I'm from Phoenix, by the way. Um, I'm not sure how it's like in the rest of the country or anywhere else, but out here, they actually got that for $50. So, I thought they literally would be out of stock, and I was wrong. So, other than that, this is our April Fool's. Um, prank or the channel prank dust so to speak so happy April Fool's Day which means you can still actually get the game out there the rumors have been hearing that on Google and I actually had to sing Zoom them by the way by accident um you can still actually buy them on the shelves so that's pretty awesome um I I just had to just check in to see uh you know just 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 to check in the game if they actually still have that and this should actually be a little bit off topic um I know Splatoon 3 is supposed to be coming out along with um I, I don't know what other Nintendo Space games are coming up because they are supposed to be making um, a Splatoon 3 next year, I think. And let's see, they got Team Sonic Racing. I never, well, actually, I never put any of the, the, the Sonic Racing games. And they got Super, Super Mega Ball Blitz, only for $30. And of course, um, I'm not sure if, if I'll be able to see it in the, in the, the section. But they're supposed to have like Super Smash Brothers Ultimate in, in stock, even though I already got the game myself. So I just wanted to share this with all, just to give you a little price. Unless, maybe I could be wrong. If you can see all the prices here, because normally they're $60, they're now $49.99. So for the Animal Crossing New Horizons, it's $49.94. Oh, my bad. $49.94. Mario Kart Deluxe is the same price, along with Super Mario 3D World Bosses Fury. And Paper Mario Origami King, which I want to play because I've played all three of the Paper Mario games of the series, or at least the franchise. So I'm guessing, besides what the prank that Nintendo did to us, they actually jotted down the price by $10. So that would definitely would be good, at least for Nintendo size. For Nintendo, thank you so much. Or Domi got this mess done. Um, that you're actually um, uh, jotting down the price because this would be easier or but yeah, you'll get them more sales um, for basically like any Mario or N Nintendo fans to actually get the game so sort of popper on the market. And, pardon me, I'm like salivating because my braces. They're actually all uh, Super Mario Brothers. Um, I'm not sure which one that is. Super Mario Maker 2, that's out, not a surprise. And Super Smash Brothers Ultimate is out, not a surprise either because I'm still gonna actually get the, the game thanks to Daniel that, that wanted to. Um, basically ship it to me. I know you are mine before, well, we had a bad argument. And yeah, basically, they still got some 3D All-Stars on the market. So that is a huge plus 
So that means, um, just like you know, it's kind of weird. The GameStop that's actually closed down, they don't actually sell the game anymore. The, um, no, the one that I go to, they, they actually don't have any more in stock. So my best bet is that you can get the Super Mario Duty All-Stars at Walmart. Or at least maybe at the mall that I actually go to. I'm not sure how it's like where you live. But I just wanted to make a little update, just so you know, because I've been wanting to get that game, like, badly, because, you know, I did grow up with the, well, Super Mario 64, Super Mario Sunshine, and Super Mario um, Galaxy, and I'm good, so I can get it, like, later on, because they got plenty on stock. I mean, I'm not sure how long this will last, I'm not sure if this is, like, a prank of Nintendo's hand, but that's, that's a good thing. So, I I need to actually get back at the house, because I already did my grocery shopping for the evening, just to rest a little bit, and watch Chucky, and... I'll probably go back out um, later on. So, other than that, I decided I decided to get back at the house. <sighs> but yeah, other than that, I decided to make a little tour because they actually got plenty on stock right now, which is really good. <sighs> okay, so other than that, just let you know, once again, um, I think Nintendo did like a you know a little error or prank, so to speak that I doubt we actually don't have any more copies, but apparently, at least the Walmart where I go to, um, they do, so it's pretty awesome. And, okay, see, I gotta clean these damn braces. Uh, because I think, I, think, I didn't get the chance to or I was too lazy. So, I don't know, I decided to make a little, a little um, talk while I'm actually here today, and yeah, so. I don't know, I'll just let you know, that's basically the Walmart that I actually go to up here that, you know, I used to shop to, because I used to go to one in Christown. But yeah, I cannot believe they actually have seven in stock. Like, Dion, can you believe that? I cannot. So, I don't know, basically, how I'm going to say this, before I actually cut this off, Mario has not died. He's still alive. I think the way some people say this is because they want to get the copy. And they doubt that Nintendo's not selling them. Well, at this Walmart <laughs> where I'm at, because I... No, I did a video on that yesterday. There are three copies, and now there's seven more copies. Because usually once they're out, they're out. They, they wouldn't be selling them after um, to, um, yesterday. So, I think I'm going to clear. Which means I can get the game later on when I save up. <sighs> but yeah, other than that, Super Mario is alive. <laughs> is alive. So, I'm trying to do his little voice.